Yo, what is going on guys? My name is Jack Silkstone. Tonight I have a very special video for you guys. First of all, I'm joined by the one and only Archie Deves. Come on. It is a special one. It's a very special one because we are here after Fort Park is actually closed. And we're going to be heading into the Fort Park cabins today to show you guys the brand new Swarm Rooms. You excited? I, <laughs> I'm full of joy. We, we Go on. are the first people to stay in the Swarm Rooms. Yeah, so these rooms were only recently announced and um, they haven't officially opened yet. But um, Fort Park have allowed us to come in today to come and show you guys around them. So yeah, just full transparency, we haven't paid to stay here tonight. Fort Park have allowed us to stay here for free. But I'm very excited. I'm very excited. We've both stayed here um, at the Fort Shark cabins once before. Yeah, yeah. So even just the whole experience we're going to be filming tonight, we're going to go to a quiz in a little bit. And tomorrow we have a really special video planned. With these swarm rooms, you basically get unlimited fast track on the swarm all day long. So tomorrow we're going to take on the challenge of riding the swarm non-stop all day. It's, it? it's going to be a bad <laughs> one. So keep an eye for that video coming soon. Um, and of course you get your normal kind of warp shark cabins unlimited fast track until 11 a.m. as well but we're just going to be hitting swarm all day so yeah we're going to make our way down to the room now and we're going to show you what they're like oh exciting very exciting so yeah we're going to head through the shark and we'll meet you when we get to the rooms so yeah you're on the lower level um, down here and it's pretty easy to spot these rooms because as you can see the standard kind of rooms all have these blue doors of course you'll know if you've stayed here before but the brand new swarm rooms have these custom doors look at that now i think we're room 175 which is a little bit further down but yeah look at these so you've got custom doors and of course a beautiful view across the park and you can see the swarm itself which we're going to be riding tomorrow all day long. Oh, I can't. <laughs> Jarvis, no, it's very really nice touch on the doors. Yeah. It says, we fled, we fled. come in. Come in. And then, Look at that. I think on our one, it says, taking, taking shelter, shelter, no entry. entry. So yeah, the theme literally starts before you even step in. And it's a nice green door. Now, I will admit, we have already been inside, we dropped our bags off and stuff. Right, no, 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 I've never been in this is our first time reaction. Right, let's head in though, get it open mate. There we go. So as I said, no one has actually stayed in these rooms yet, so it's really cool being able to be here. But yeah, this is just an initial look. Look at that, we will like dive into everything that I'm showing you right now. But I'll just show you, literally the whole room. Hey. Head into the bathroom as well. So yeah, immediately you'll notice just how different all of the walls are compared to previously. Because previously they had, um, you had like a Fort Park vinyl there, um, but then all of these walls were pretty blank. Um, same with the drawers and stuff. But yeah, the cool thing about these rooms is just the pure amount of Easter eggs that they've crammed in here. So I don't even know where to start. Let's take the drawers, for example. As you can see, Les Cougar, it's so cool to see that name again. He was a huge part of like the Swarm marketing campaign. We've got um, reference 150312. That's of course the date that the ride opened, the 15th of March, oh, God, 2012. Mean, <laughs> that's awesome. And then you've got Project LC12. That was of course the code name for the Swarm. And that was on the website until August. It was, yeah. That, that was where they did the grand reveal. Um, but yeah, with the project name, that's literally what stage we're at with Exodus right now. Of course, Project Exodus is just the code name for that roller coaster. So although we're all so used to saying it, like I've literally said it 100,000 times on a live stream. Exodus, 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 Exodus. When the ride itself opens, it's not gonna be called Project Exodus, just like, the Swarm is not called LC12. So Jack's going to have to turn up a live stream. Oh no, don't know about that. Um, but yeah, what else have we got? This is one of my favourite parts of the room. This is obviously the visual for the big um, billboard that you go through in the ride. That was oh, actually I, added I, in I, 2013. Sorry, I was just... Go on. I have that on a canvas and I run that. That's really That's nice. So yeah, when the ride originally opened, that um, billboard wasn't actually part of it. Um, but in 2013, they turned around the back rows of the Swarm and added this awesome billboard which still stands today. On the bed itself, you've got this cool, massive um, Swarm vinyl. Now this is all, of course, concept art that was created to kind of um, help them build the ride, basically. So this would have been created by the designers and showed in like planning meetings and concept meetings. 
So yeah, it's really cool to see this like original concept art on this scale. It's absolutely massive. And it's high quality. It is high, very high quality. Oh, There's no pixelation on that, don't worry. Yeah, very cool indeed. And then just down here, again, this is what Deves is saying about how the website was kind of all lc12.net. LC12 I remember visiting that website so many times. Every day. On, was it like August the 8th, I think, oh, maybe? Mate, I, can't. I remember now, it was like, it was, <laughs> I generally think August the 8th. Like, you can, if I'm wrong, I'll, I'll give you prime. <laughs> uh, but I think it was August the 8th. They announced it, and I was, it was like, it might have been a midday. I remember so, having to they had refresh. It on the park. Like, I remember seeing That's people cool. on the park, and they had that light. Yeah, all of this branding was everywhere, all over the park. In fact, if you've been watching my Project Exodus update, sorry to keep talking about it, back when they had, like, swarm graphics over at um, Stealth, they had, like, barriers for the swarm. They actually then moved that over to Old Town, and it was, it was the fence that kind of blocked off Logger's Leap when that closed. So that's a cool little Easter egg for you. All the swarm was kind of moved around the park from Stealth to Old Town. Yeah, really cool. Now, a massive part of this room is a coffee machine that you get, some Nespresso. Unfortunately, I'm literally the worst person to talk about this. I don't really drink coffee. Are you a big coffee fan? No. Nah, nah, nah. So, unfortunately, we're not the best people. But you've actually got your own Nespresso machine. There's some pods in there. Deep you've got some cool, in. like, green camo mugs there. Very nice. Yeah, unfortunately, I'm not, I'm not able to give a good review of the coffee machine, no, but it looks like a good one. chocolate, I would. I think there is, mate. Oh. There you go, look at that. WC. There you know, go. Maybe. <laughs> maybe I'll treat myself to that. And then if we uh, head into the bathroom, as you can see, we've got some cool designs in here again. And it goes around the entire room. It's on the back of the door as well. Look at that. And there's actually some really cool stuff on the front of the door where you've got even more kind of concept art and construction photos. That's literally the plane that now sits on Swarm Island. You've got the church and the station. You've got the island layout. It's all so cool. Yeah, loads and loads of stuff that you can just geek out about. Wait, is that Raptor? I think it no, might here be. Here it like the Tower. Yeah, because obviously Raptor's built a Guardland. We went and rode it recently. They kind of borrowed some of the concept art. Very cool, and I know some of these uh, um, kind of quotes and writing on here is from the Twitter account that um, like Les Coogan was supposedly running back in the day. So yeah, it's really cool. You can literally just geek out in this room and just sit here reading everything. So yeah, if you are a big fan of the Swarm and you want to immerse yourself in the world of the Swarm, and uh, this is definitely the room to book. And as I said, a massive perk of getting this room is uh, obviously unlimited fast track on any ride until 11 a.m. on the second day of your visit. And then you've literally got the entirety of the second day to ride the swarm as many times as you want. And you just see how well we do with that perk tomorrow. Yes. Also, there's a game. A little you, game, if, look at that. There's QR codes you can scan. And it gives you a game called the Swarm Fight Back. Yeah, so if you're, if you're laying in bed a little bit bored, You've got a game that you can play, it's based on the swarm. You've got to try and get a high score, mate. I'll probably have to. <laughs> oh, they're coming a bit fast. <laughs> Is it until one of them... Oh dear. Oh, there you go. Oh, there you go. You've got to try and beat Deezer's score. And yeah, another cool thing with these rooms, if you are sleeping more than two or three people, Obviously, there's two of us in here tonight, so we've got the double bed and the single. Um, but if there are more of you, then this is actually another bunk bed, so you can have three or four people, depending on if you want to share. Um, but yeah, that is the swarm room. Looking very, very cool indeed. I think that's pretty much everything to show you. Um, yeah, as you said, when you're in the room, you can obviously change this to let people know if, you, if the room's occupied or not. But yeah, there we go. Right now, we're gonna head down into um, Infinity because there's a quiz going on, isn't there? Two and a half hours after the park closes, I believe, every day there's a quiz. So we're gonna go and take part. We we know our Fort Park knowledge. I don't know if it is a Fort Park quiz, but we're gonna take you guys along with us. If it's a Fort Park quiz and we lose. Oh, that's embarrassing. Uh, Jack will delete his channel. That's embarrassing, I actually will. But yeah, absolutely gorgeous views across the park. We're gonna head over into the dome to get some dinner and hopefully win a quiz. What a lift deal. <laughs> what a lift, lift deal. deal. Absolutely gorgeous. <laughs> So we just had a lovely meal in Vibes. We uh, took part in the quiz, as you saw. And we won. Oh, unfortunately we didn't win. 
but we got every single question in the Fort Park round right, so I'm happy with That's that. That's what matters. That's what matters. It was the movie rounds and riddles that we, we didn't do too well in. Although we didn't know that uh, The Walking Dead was longer than... Nah, Colossus. apparently the longest ride at Fort Park is The Walking Dead. We put Colossus. And it, it's not even Colossus. Saw was longer. You yeah. said that, to yeah, be fair. But yeah, we've had a good evening. And look at this, guys. Look at that gorgeous view. It's absolutely amazing and genuinely you can't get a view like this at any other theme park in the UK. This is why I love Fort Park so much. Look at that. So yeah, if you stay at the Fort Park cabins, you've actually got the dome open, the playground just down here is open and obviously this kind of balcony area is open. So you can come and look at this beautiful view. But yeah, absolutely gorgeous. We're gonna make our way back to the room now. everyone oh. <laughs> no on a real we have actually just woken up we're obviously ready now for our day um but yeah did you have a good sleep sure this is a bold thing <laughs> well, i think i might be like the comfiest merlin bed i've slept on yeah honestly really nice night um got a good sleep in and as you can see it is an absolutely beautiful day today and of course today is the day we're taking on the challenge look at the timing on that we're going to be riding the swarm all day long so yeah i'm going to end this video right here and we're going to start that video so yeah thank you all so much for watching our little video from the brand new swarm rooms as i said they're available now so feel free to go and book one over on the fort shark cabin website and yeah, thanks for Archie Deeves for coming along. Yeah. I shall see you in the next video. My name's Jack Silkstone. My name's Archie Deeves. Good. Bye.